currently 4.30 in the morning and I am trying to make the sunrise. So what I'm trying to do is there's an abandoned plane that I want to take a picture of and I have the coordinates for it. I, I went on Google Earth and everything, but if it's really there, who knows? So it's two and a half hour drive going down to it's near Lancaster, so near which is right above LA. So I'll keep you updated. It's gonna be exciting. Well, it might be a hit or miss. So is it worth waking up 4:30? Who knows? Alright, I'm here. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if I, I'm not gonna trespass. This is the Air Force. Look at this. Uh, yeah, I don't know. I don't see no plane. Right, let me check. Yeah, I don't know. Let me get my zoom lens and see if I can see it from where I, where I am. Well, I decided not. I'm doing it. I'm not doing it. I'm not that gutsy. But I do take some pictures of some cactuses. Looks really nice. I need to take more with my wide angle lens. But yeah, that's it. My hands are freezing cold. It's literally 20 degrees out. So, see ya. I will catch you guys in LA. Actually staying at a friend's house and they have yeah they let me have a guest room that I'm staying in so pretty nice hard drop say hi <laughs> what up I'm vlogging by the way so I'm just, I'm just, just say hi oh gosh hi <laughs> <laughs> thanks for letting me stay at your house of course and then this is what Riley right yes Say hi. Smiley, Riley. Bro, just... Bro, I do not miss LA traffic. Not at all. Not at all. All right, so now I'm at... Well, I'm going thrifting. So I'm at Society of St. DePaul. And supposedly it's it's the largest like thrift shop or thrift warehouse uh, in LA. So let's see what we can find. I'm trying to Christmas shop too while I'm at it. Why do I always feel like the men's section is always? 10 times smaller than the women's section. So if you get a tiny corner and then the rest of the whole warehouse is all women's stuff. I did not find anything. I mean, it's very hit or miss, these kind of places, so. Well, I think now I want to go to a photo spot and see what's up. I think it's a parking garage where the, everything is red. So definitely want to check that out. Well, I think I found it. It's right here. All right, time to get some time to get some good shots. Times like these where traveling alone kind of like gets to you and I don't know it's like with the city I'm in LA right now I'm with the city of like millions of people you 
you still feel like alone. I don't know. It's like, I, like during like these down times, that's kind of when it hits you. Like you know when you're doing stuff constantly, you you don't really like mind like the fast paced stuff, but like when things slow down for you, that's kind of where uh, you kind of feel alone or lo lonely. When I was in downtown LA, I feel it felt so congested and like crowded, and I think I just had to get away from everything. <laughs> yeah, I'm in Glendale, which is north of LA, yeah. and yeah, I, don't, I just needed space to breathe because I felt like I was anxious and like claustrophobic, <laughs> and yeah, I don't know. It's it's just really hard to be in LA with all the traffic too. And I don't know, everyone still has work, so I experience all the bulk of the, the the cars going in and out. On top of that, I lost my AirPods in Death Valley. I don't know, I swore I packed it. <coughs> I've been losing everything at that, in that trip. I lost the mittens, and now I can't find my AirPods. So, full L, full L's, man, this trip. But... Still grateful for the experience for sure. I don't I wouldn't trade it up, but we got another day of LA tomorrow and then two days of San Diego and then back home for Christmas. to shoot here for college back in the days uh, it's like when I first went to UCLA it's kind of like the first boss that I saw on Instagram and I Google search I Google Earth trying to find this location even like yeah Google every subway in LA and finally found it so definitely trying to reshoot this and hopefully it'll look better than the last time All right, see you later. So nice. Uh, hello. Oh, you're so What's up, man? How's it going? How long are you guys down here for? Uh, till Monday Sunday. or Sunday? <laughs> yeah. Okay. Oh, we're eating this thing at this place, and it's gonna be really good because I researched it. But then, um, dink it and sink it. First. <laughs> All right. Oh, 
I can tell you the price is the house. Yeah. I think I'm okay. Plus. Alright, can you go to the plus one? Alright everybody. Now I am in San Diego where it's supposed to be very relaxing and yeah I'm just here to have a good time. But to start off the day, I have a photo shoot with a model and it's from 12 to 3 and yeah so we're meeting at a mall and also various places so all right so I'm at a restaurant and this is actually one of our spots that we're actually gonna shoot at so me I didn't get lunch so I got lunch and sat at the spot where we're shooting at uh, so that I'm uh, pretty much we don't get kicked out and we have a legit reason to stay here All right, so I'm here today with Danny. This is the, our model for today, and I'm, I'll be plugging her Instagram like right here. <laughs> and all right, all right. Can I have you uh, put one foot like on top of that? And then, yeah, and then come shift your, yeah, like that. And then kind of like stick your foot up. Yeah, there you go. <laughs> Dude, I ran out of space. Nice. You top out. All the way to the top.
Monica. Monica. Oh, this is where the San Diego beats where San Diego in beats rain. They freak out. <laughs> Don't do anything. <laughs> Cheers. Alright, so the trip is over and now I'm going home. Eight hours of driving and yeah, this week has gone by really fast and I really appreciate all the people that I've met and also, you know, just the friends that I connected with along the way and I couldn't trade this experience for anything. I don't regret a single thing and I mean, there are times where solo traveling kind of gets you down and you kind of get in the feels. But I think overall, it's a very positive experience and I would do this again. So, we created so many amazing photos and I'm looking forward to doing more and traveling the world more. So until next time, I'll see you again and I'll peace out.